We've established that standing waves on a transmission line can be a problem. You might imagine that we would want to have a parameter we can use to describe how bad the standing waves are on a transmission line. This parameter is called the voltage standing wave ratio. VSWR, you might also see it as SWR, and we'll just use S. So the vol voltage standing wave ratio, S, is V, the maximum voltage magnitude, divided by the minimum. And this is dimensionless, there's no units for it. The VSWR is a measure of how efficiently radio frequency power is delivered to a load on a transmission line. If we know V naught plus and we know the reflection coefficient, we can write out the expression for S with respect to V naught plus and the reflection coefficient. For example, since V max occurs when the positive and negative voltage phasors are parallel, we can write V max amplitude is V naught plus times 1 plus the reflection coefficient voltage at the load. And since V min occurs when the positive and negative voltage phasors are anti-parallel, we can write V min with just a minus sign, 1 minus Then we can plug these in, we can cancel the V naught plus terms, and we're going to get a more simple expression. We get 1 plus the reflection coefficient magnitude, I'll put voltage and load there, and 1 minus the reflection coefficient, the voltage at the load. Question for you, is a smaller or a larger VSWR value better? 